CS Grad Award for Worst Developer. This next award's pretty special because it's one of the awards that we weren't bribed to rig. Bethesda. Electronic Arts. All you care about is money. This town deserves a better class of criminal. Blizzard. Uh, just was wondering, is this uh, an out of season April Fool's joke? Uh... Todd Howard. Versus Todd Howard. Just works. These NPCs are not scripted. You can walk all the way to the top of that. Go where you want, watch, do whatever you want. This is the golden age of gaming. Make the Have you ever made it past a single YouTube tutorial on animation principles? Do you think it's acceptable to go until 2011 without giving your players a jumping animation? Is your creative output best summarized by a sarcastic Fleetwood Mac song? Holy shit, what a boomer fucking reference. You guys call me old. Congratulations. You may be just what they're looking for down at Bethesda Softworks. Bethesda's good old-fashioned quality has become such a recognizable meme at this point. It's essentially a staple of their image, ingrained in their own brand itself. Horses spinning faster than a Beyblade? Classic Bethesda. Radiant conversations as realistic as a Tommy Wiseau script? Guess who? A modding system that functions about as well as a rocket made from duct tape and drunken ingenuity? You guessed it the Big B. Overall, Bethesda likes to drag Todd out on stage whenever they want to try and seem fun and friendly, but with everything that's gone on recently, it's worth remembering that no matter how charming Todd Howard may be, there's always a Pete Hines lurking in the shadows. <laughs>